He's oh, that's an alchemist. That's what we want. That's what we want. That's what we want. That's what we want. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Oh my God, there's 17 of them. Tell me how this looks, guys. Is he? Does he have a thong on? Do we ever get out of this rainy jungle? I have I have no idea. But I kind of like the way that the, the ladies are shimmering in the back. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Conan Exiles, guys. We're going for thralls again today. I know that's what you do in Conan Exiles, right? You go thralling. Well, uh, this is going to be a thrilling thrall ride like you've never thrown before. I, I have no idea why I just said that. There's a... Uh, <laughs> There's there's an encampment that we we all know and love this stormhold camp and uh, it's the the easiest to check and I'm looking I was scouting earlier and I thought I saw a thrall that did not have a sword or a shield and I think that might be a crafting thrall and that's kind of what we're looking for today and um, when I mean kind of I mean we're coming back with a crafting thrall no archers no soldiers no magus none of that we need to start beefing up our our, our crafting game, you know, armor smiths and weapon smiths and, and stuff, you know, we got a chef, but I want more. So I think the easiest way, there's, there's two elves up here that are going to aggro if we get too close, and I'm starting to see, I think we, we probably just going to need to go up the coast here. All right, just doing a little bit of scouting from the water, and look, that's what I was seeing earlier. You see where my dot is over there? Not the one that just ran off. That does not look like a soldier. Looks like something else. I don't know what it is. So what we're going to do is we're going to try to draw him out. We're probably going to need to knock out everything in the whole Dadgum village. It's going to be ugly. Yeah, that's definitely something. Definitely something. Oh, wait. Is that like an NPC or something? I mean, I know they're all NPCs, but hold up. Who is this guy? He's a merchant. Oh, specialty farming gear? Hold on. That's different. Oh, no. All right. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. This is... He's... Oh, that's an alchemist. That's what we want. That's what we want. That's what we want. That's what we want. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Oh, my God. There's 17 of them. We can't take them all on at this time. We can't. Uh, there's just too many of them. There's too many. Well, we know. There's an alchemist now. We definitely want that. Definitely, definitely, definitely. The alchemist is in the water now. Okay. Where's my, where's my people? Where's my people? Dang, an alchemist, you guys. That is going to work out great. Okay. Where, where is he? If y'all could just keep these guys occupied, for me. No, 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 there's too many of them. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's see what they're all doing. Let's see which one I want. There we go. Oh, he does have a shield. An alchemist with a shield? Okay, I need to equip this. I need to center in on this dude. I need to watch my, my the health of everybody too, man. All right. No, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. All right, here we go. Oh man, this is gonna be hard, guys. This is gonna this is gonna be tough. Peggy, why don't you put something in your hands? Do you not have a weapon, Peggy? Oh, he's going down pretty fast, actually. But, I mean, I'm I'm taking a good bit of damage, too. All right, I'll tell you what. Let's heal. See if I can do that. Never mind. I stopped healing. Okay, I have an idea. Let's equip the bow. Uh-oh, they, bro they broke my helmet. All right, heal, 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 heal. Ouch! That hurt, dude. That hurt. Okay, seven. Beautiful. Oh, don't go too far. Don't go too far. Don't go too far. What is wrong with you? You do not have an iron trunch. That's what's wrong with you. Okay, run. D dodge. <laughs> oh my god. This is a pile, guys. A pile. 
They were all supposed to have an iron trench. I wonder if for some reason they didn't break it or something. Uh-uh. This, 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 this is right here is bad news. Okay. I'm going to try to just go up here. Nope. They're going to chase me up here. That's fine. Okay. I need a heal, man. Heal, 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 heal. Okay. To hell with this fighter. How intense is this, guys? He's he's almost down. If we get this guy down by himself, oh my god, though. Yes, knock, get knocked out, get knocked out. This is a war. Ouch. Ouch. Okay, I need to heal again. Get in the region, get in the region, get in the region. I just need everybody to heal. Everybody heal. Everybody heal. I'm just shooting arrows now. Okay. Let's get back. Uh huh. Okay. Okay, let's go in again. Alchemist is going down now. We got enough health. Dang it. Whew. Oh my gosh! I, you know this is what we what we what we get for not killing things and singling them out. But I'm a barefooted and stuff. And the guy, hey, he freaking broke my hat. No, 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 no! He's almost there, guys. He's almost there. My finger hurts. Okay, 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 okay. Wait. <laughs> Oh my god, it hurts. Okay, he's down. He's actually down. Alright. We need to make sure we have a rope in hand. Where? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Yes. Yes. Okay. Where's the where's the alchemist? Here. Going. And we're leaving now. We're leaving. <laughs> we're leaving now, guys. Everybody just run. Everybody run. Everybody run. Oh my god, that was a hectic fight. <laughs> you think I gotta repair my armor or what? I mean, don't get me wrong, it wasn't full before I left, but... I wonder how bad it is. I mean, if it broke two pieces, everything is probably almost broken, if not all the way broken. I was about to be butt naked fighting him. I was supposed to put a bedroll down, too. I got one around here, but I didn't know exactly where it was. How chaotic was that? Okay, is everybody, is everybody following me now? Yes. Oh, God. You gotta be kidding me. An alligator right now? Uh-uh. I ain't even worried. I'm seriously not even worried about it. I'm just... We're just going home. We're just going home. How's my armor look? Oh, yeah. <laughs> just pants and shirt left. But we got it, man. Okay, let's go home and break the sucker. And we gotta go out for another expedition. So this camp I've never really been to before. The weather's pretty horrible, but... Um... So they're elves... But they're not the same elves that we fought with the magic. There's a there's a separate faction altogether. And because it's so dark, I am going to avoid this fight and see what these plants are right here. What is this? Just regular plant fibers? Okay. I thought it was something special. It looked like something special. So there's a little camp of thralls over there. But that's not faction thralls. So the way that the mod distributes thrall spawns... Um, for factions is they don't do them where they would really overlap with the regular ones. Look all the snakes in there. Because that's like made into the map, right? So they can't, they can't really do that. They just put them at different places. So the camp, it looks like to get to them, I'm going to have to go up this tree. Okay. Yep. Yeah. That's definitely a, uh... Are there mages for this faction? Hard to tell. Okay, is she the only one? No, there's a few others. There's a few others. I kinda... We might knock these out too, we'll see. But I'm more interested in the crafting... The crafting thralls than anything. And I don't, I don't know what these are though. I don't know what to look for really. Let's just get up close. 
Hello? Oh no, that's a fighter. Uh oh, there's a few. Okay, that is a a fighter as well, and that one is a fighter as well. Okay, we're we're just gonna avoid these guys. Well, my team's not. My team is it. Ouch. Let me get my stand back and. Uh... Ooh, kind of hurt. I'm bleeding. Okay, they left me alone though. Well, until my bleed stops. I should have brought some bandages. I had no idea, man. What are y'all doing? Y'all ready to fight? <laughs> okay. Sheesh. Y'all all right? Everybody's health is good. How weird. More, more elves over here. Oh wait, who is this guy? Who is this? Who is this? This is a performer, an elven dancer. That's exactly what we want. <laughs> That's exactly what we want. All right, what do we do here? What do we do? What do we do? There's a lot of them. All right, here we go. Oh my God. Okay, the bleeds are bad. The bleeds are bad. The bleeds are very bad. That type of sh that type of stuff will kill you. Oh no 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 no! Yeah, bleeds bleeds are very bad. Okay. I mean, he's almost down. He is almost down. Is he down? Where did he go? Where? Oh, there he is. There he is. Tut! Let's go! Let's go, y'all! We're done! <laughs> We're done, guys. We kidnapped the performer. He had short pants. <laughs> tell, tell him how this looks, guys. <laughs> Actually, is he... Does he have a thong on? Oh, my God. How am I going to explain this? Peggy, listen, it's not what it looks like, baby. Well, I believe our thralls are cooked. <laughs> we got we got a dancing boy and we got a an alchemist. So the the dancing boy is not going to give us anything special outside of being able to remove our corruption, which we really need. And probably probably to tell the truth, will probably serve as great entertainment. I've I've never had my own dancing for <laughs> dancing boy before. Should I just put him in this corner, just in case he's shameful? Let me, let's let's see what he looks like. All right, come on out, bro. Show us your. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh, you even got the you even <laughs> you even got the crazy hair uh the crazy crazy makeup huh? Oh. All right. What? Well, <laughs> you got a little hot move. I like it, dude. <laughs> I like it. So as you can see, guys, uh, my corruption just disappeared, which is, I mean, if there's, if this can remove bad vibes from you, <laughs> I don't know what can. So he does have a serpent man sword. Look at the health on this guy. I mean, he's not going to fight for us or anything, but I'm interested to see about this weapon. Holy crap. A sword with blasphemous ancient style. Health damage 44. Armor Penetration 8. It is not considered a legendary weapon, which is actually good because I can um, I can, I can repair this on the fly. Uh, this was a pretty cool weapon that I had found a little while back from one of the Thralls, and it's only a hardened steel sword. So being that this was uh, only like 33 weapon damage when I wanted one-handed, that's, that's pretty cool. The, don't get me wrong, the Whirlwind Blades are awesome, but being legendary, I have to actually get them again, and... It, it really sucks if I want to use a shield or on a horseback or any of that stuff. So having that weapon there is good. That's that's a heck of a replacement, to tell you the truth. Let's see how it looks. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, I like those attacks, too. I very much like the attacks. And, I mean, we're on the back of Amber, right? And we could just pull it out and zoop. <laughs> I like it. I like it a lot. All right, Amber. I'm going to get, uh, I'm gonna get down now, and we're going to check out... The other, uh, let me, oh, no, no, I didn't mean to do that. Amber, I didn't, get off my shoulders, babe. 
I didn't mean to. Dang it. All right, you good? You fine? All right. <laughs> so let's check out our other one. So our other one is a Stormhold Alchemist. Now, for the Alchemist, we're going to want to put that in the Alchemy table, I believe. Um, I mean, that only makes sense, right? There are a few tables that it might benefit from, though. Studies of the ancient arts can hold a thrall. So we're going to try it in here first. And it does not look like it has that. There might be a special kind of thrall to go in there. But this is the alchemy desk. And you can see all the recipes that we have right here. It's basically a bunch of different um, potions and stuff. And if we put the Stormhold Alchemist in here, it gives us some access to dyes. While this is not, while this is not incredibly powerful, it, it, it is really cool to see. Oh gosh, we we risked our lives, guys, to be able to dye some stuff white for Stormhold. So the cool thing about this is that if you were to take the alchemist and put him uh, from another um, faction, I guess you could call it. Let's say the Elvenor faction. Okay, the Elvenor faction would have their own dyes based on what color this is. You see how it says it's like uh, the Stormhold white and the Stormhold blue? That's that's basically where that comes from. So I just want to take it out and see really quick if there is any merit to putting it there. No. And uh, let's go to the Firebolt Cauldrons down below and see if we can get anything in there. Firebolt Cauldrons... Alchemist, look at that. Now, that's what I'm talking about, guys. This is why I really got the Alchemist. It's because you can make oil right here with Bark and Icker. And you could already kind of do that with the um, the press, you know, get oil. It's not, it's not that big of a deal. But Demon Fire Orb is what we need for, I believe, what's called star metal. It's a meteorite that can be um, that can be harvested with very high-end tools or <laughs> these fire orbs. We can also make grease orbs with the tar and the water orbs, and we do uh, still have the dye as well. And gaseous orbs, ain't nothing wrong with this. I don't think I have any puffball mushrooms, but I, I, I don't think they're that hard to find. And gas orbs can do a lot of damage, especially in those camps that we keep messing around in. Um, we haven't even started taking the legendary camps yet, but gas orbs are going to be the thing. So, I, I mean, we can make some demon fire orbs going forward, and uh, we could probably go visit the north. Uh, over here, there is some really, really cool stuff I want to visit. Um, there's an arcane tablet that we can get the arcane spells from, as well as, I believe, there's some other stuff around here that we could probably look into to visit the northern biomes. And, of course, get, you know, maybe get, maybe get some cool stuff. I am going to need to bring a few creatures with me and thralls out there with me to go and i might continue looking for a few of the um the the thralls as i go to camps but we're not we're not gonna i'm not gonna do videos constantly on getting camp after camp after camp because that's gonna get pretty old if we do see something and when we're passing my camps of opportunity we'll probably take them but from 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 here going forward, I'll probably just, when I end up grabbing thralls and putting them in the tables, I'll update you guys on the recipes that I get and uh, everything else. And, I mean, honestly, as far as productivity, we got it good, man. We could, we could, we have some more space in the wheel now, and we have a few mages that we can take with us to the cold. I, I don't specifically know if I'm going to take the mages or if I'm going to take a combination of creatures, because chemo is still super, super strong. And I believe will probably give us the best chance for survival um, in that in that crazy uh, in that crazy cold area. Uh, there's also a dungeon that I'd like to go to. Uh, it's called the Midnight Grove. That's all going to be coming up in the next episodes, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed this one. If you did, give me some dap on that like button to show you support, and you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Zuljan signing off, and we'll see you next time. Break it down.